Oh wait, no, there we go. Oh, stuff was just falling off before I even got there. Holy crap. <laughs> We're like a rocket, a cardboard rocket. Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Neil and welcome back to some more Beam and G Drive. Uh, way back in February, I believe, we took a look at this mod right here, the Cardboard Covet, and it was just... It was, the, it was the best mod I've ever seen in my entire life. I think we can all agree on that, that this thing is up there with the big dogs as far as mods go. Well, the creator actually made a sequel, a follow-up to this that was just released, and it is amazing. So say hello to the Pessima Cardboard <laughs> Edition. Yes, isn't it a thing? <laughs> isn't it a thing of beauty? Look at the detail on the cardboard. Look at that immaculate cardboard. It's the cleanest cardboard I've ever seen in my entire life. It's, I, I don't know. I don't know how to explain these mods. Um, <laughs> without laughing, that is. I think they're actually really creative and really awesome, but some might say they're a little bit tacky. They belong over on the subreddit called Shitty Car Mods. And you know, I, I agree with that, but just because they're shitty doesn't mean they can't be awesome at the same time. I mean, look, at that attention to detail, he has even the, I'm pretty sure even the, the duct tape is actually like what's holding these together. So let's like, let's see if we can like grab a piece of this right here. So like, so the strength up to 100. Oh yeah, look at that. It's holding on by the tape. There goes the tape. And you can just <laughs> rip these off. And if you don't, if you haven't watched the uh, first video, I highly recommend it because this cardboard actually acts like you would expect cardboard to act. So it's really pretty dang awesome. So obviously first things first, we got to crash this this thing so let's go ahead and reset restart it here and just go down the old tunnel here if you guys are wondering why I'm being so quiet I have a lot of recording to do today so I don't really want to strain my voice so you're, you're getting a ASMR Neil the a very soft timid Neil but I, I hope you guys don't mind if you want me to talk like this all the time let me know with a like button anyway we're gonna crash this cardboard car here we go I imagine yep all the cardboard pieces are just gonna fly off in every which direction. Holy crap, what just exploded? I think that was the spoiler that just exploded back here. I'm not really sure. Anyway, most of the car actually held up. These pieces are still here. I'm kind of surprised by that, but pretty much every single other cardboard bit just absolutely vaporized. Actually, is this... Oh god, why are we stuck to the wall? Come on, get out of there. There we go. So yeah, it actually acts like a piece you would expect a piece of cardboard to act. I remember testing it and, um, it does actually act different than uh, the regular fenders that would be be on there, which is pretty darn awesome. And d honestly, dude, if you did this to every single car in the game, I would not even be mad in the slightest. All right, so obviously we got to crash these things into each other. That's just kind of how it works if you realize what game we're in. So we're going to go ahead and set this one up right about here. Oh, this thing sounds awful, by the way. I mean, I think it's pretty much just the stock pessimist sound. But just something about the cardboard there just makes it sound... <laughs> even worse if that's possible so we're gonna go all the way down here and i mean this should be pretty simple we're just gonna run them into each other and just watch cardboard fly into the sky so i think this is probably far enough so let's just go ahead and whip it around is this a drift vehicle no it is not but we did it anyway so here we go it's on that right there and just set this off on a course of destruction and let's go ahead and do this guys we're probably not going to get the most speed ever but let's be honest here these are not race cars so here we go get some slow motion and <laughs> oh my god that was actually surprisingly loud okay oh no oh no we have a fire oh this thing is just gonna oh it's just gonna go up in flames cardboard the cardboard is extremely flammable you know it'd be awesome if this like started melting down and just turning black I know those are kind of impossible features to add, but it would be cool, you gotta admit. But yeah, it seems like the cardboard actually is pretty well attached on the back. I don't know how he's attached these to the back of the car. They're just kind of morphed into the back, or else there's some nails I'm not seeing. But the parts on the side and the front just seem to fly off for no good reason. So that's kind of cool. But uh, yeah, let's go ahead and crash this some more since uh, this is the new standard for crash test maps for the most part. We're just gonna throw it off every which way we can. But before we do that, actually, I want to show you something. For that, we need to switch to nighttime because this is probably the best feature of any mod I've ever seen. So it's nighttime. Let's get on the light, turn on the lights there. And if we push the M key, <laughs> are you guys ready for this? Three, 
two, one. Boom! Look at that. We have neon lights underneath. I'm not sure why. I guess he's just adding to the tackiness of this mod or something, but personally, I think this is probably the best thing I've ever seen. So let's, let's actually get some air with this thing because I'm kind of curious if the light will actually cover some area if we get this thing airborne. I don't know why. I just want to see. So let's go all the way to the top of the hill. I guess that's a pretty good place to go. And uh, let's, just t let's just take it off the ramp at night. We don't do enough stuff at night. Well, actually, I have a pretty good reason for that because everything's hard to see because YouTube compresses all videos to hell when you upload. But we're going to do it anyway just because I want to see the reach of this light, how powerful these lasers on the bottom of our cardboard Pessima maybe you know it would also be kind of cool if like you can make the entire car out of this material that would just be the coolest i would i would play the hell out of that anyway here we go nope they just they just disappear i don't know what i expected are they going to show back up or did they just straight up fall off no they're still there oh man okay yeah all the cardboard that time is gone all right so let's go back up here turn the turn the day back on because i'm already getting a little bit annoyed here so i actually what is this what is this label? I thought that was Ikea. Yeah, idea. Very clever, man. We're using Ikea boxes on our uh, on our Pessima here. You know, just it just sounds so perfect. Would any of you guys do this to your car? I mean, even if it was just for a day. Like, how much money would you have to be paid to drive your car around like this? I think my, my absolute lowest I would do this for is probably 500 bucks. But what would you guys say? Let me know down below in the comments. I'm kind of curious. Anyway, um... Let's just crash this thing somewhere. I just like seeing the, the cardboard just fly all over the freaking place. I don't know why. It's just so satisfying to me. So let's just... This is a big ramp right here. We're going we're gonna to get absolutely annihilated here. But it should be pretty awesome. I kind of want to throw like a bigger engine in here to just make it like the ultimate sleeper of all time. Because this thing is pretty darn slow. There we go. Yes. <laughs> cardboard rims just flying. Or the hubcaps, I guess they are. Just flying off. Oh, that's a shame. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. All the pieces are about to go flying. Oh, you need to get tougher duct tape, apparently. I mean, they are they actually are being held on by the duct tape, which I think is a really nice touch. I have no idea how he did that. But for now, I think I'm actually going to throw a bigger engine in here just because I want to see this thing just go exceptionally fast. So additional modifications. Do you have other options here? We can, we can change the color of the neons. That's kind of cool. And, uh, okay, yeah, those are just the cardboard options. Okay, let's just go down to the engine here. And I guess we could add a guy inside, too. Because then it could be... <laughs> we, could, we could have a face to this monstrosity. So, um... Yeah, let's put a driver in there. We're gonna put the stick in here. This seems like something the stick would drive. Does it not? Anyway, uh, where's the engine? It's always hard. It's, it's kind of hard to find stuff in this game. All right, so we'll put in the uh, V6 exhaust. Why the heck not? I'm sure it'll still work, right? Uh, do we have any turbos? No. Okay, what about transmission? I don't need to deal with that flywheel. Uh, where's the actual engine? Okay, there we go. Let's put in a ooh, drag I4 engine. Okay, you know, why Why the hell not? We're probably going to pop all the tires right when we start. Uh-oh. Oh, okay. Still works. Still works. This is a very quick car, though. Oh, God. <laughs> All right, let's just do this. Is it going to be infinite tire spin? I believe it is. Yeah, that could be a problem. We are going faster, though. That is so loud, though. Yeah, well, I think we might need to go down to the... Uh... Oh, wait. No, there we go. Oh, stuff was just falling off before I even got there. Holy crap. <laughs> We're like a rocket, a cardboard rocket flying into space. Oh, no. Oh, Stig, you are so dead. You are so dead, Stig. Hey, we're going to land to the 200 bit. Wait. Oh, no. We're going to... Oh, no. We're going to... Oh. <laughs> we cracked our spine. No. Are you okay, buddy? You might uh, You might have... You might have broke your ass there. I'm not going to... I'm not going to lie, man. All right. So, that was a little bit too extreme. Let's go and... <laughs> go ahead and switch that to maybe something a little bit less crazy here. So, maybe like a... Uh, uh, what was the what was the next option for this? I don't even. Where's the engine? Come on, help me out here. All right, so let's go down to the 2.7 liter uh, V6. Maybe that'll maybe that'll be a little bit better for us. I just want to go fast, but I don't want to I don't want to just blow out the tires instantly. I just don't want to do the world's 
biggest burnout here. Okay, yeah, this seems a little bit more manageable. All right. So I'm going to actually hit this other ramp here just because I want to see. I want to go for distance this time. So let's see how fast we can get this going. It actually doesn't feel too much faster. Maybe I'm just not good with, uh, oh, 110. Are you kidding me? Come on. And there we go. Why are those pieces falling? Oh, no. <gasps> oh. <laughs> hey, you know, at least we made it uh, through, to, through the 200. Uh, Stig's probably a little bit uncomfortable. But, you know, that's okay. All right, so what do we want to crash this thing with now? I just hit my nose on the microphone. I apologize. Should we just throw him down the big old stairs of death? I think we should. That's kind of a staple of this map, isn't it? So let's go over there. And <laughs> side skirts already falling off. That's Oh, God. Okay. That's how it's going to be. I get you. I get you. I, I totally get you. All right. Let's um try that again. Ow. There we go. Okay. Okay. I guess those just don't stay on. And we don't need them anyway. Here we go. There's going to be no cardboard on this car by the time we get to the bottom. I can guarantee you that. Oh, God. And there we go. All the cardboards. Oh, wait, no, there's still some on the wheels. Is it going to fall, though? I'm actually surprised it hasn't already. Holy crap. Oh, no. Oh, no, we might hit that other burning covet there. Oh, my God. Stig! <laughs> You're dead, man. Actually, well, I mean, I don't know. I'm not I'm not a good, uh, good judge of that, but I, I, I've, I'm still waiting for that mod to come out that kind of shows the body damage on a ragdoll. And holy crap, this thing has been busy while we were gone. This thing is full-on burning right now. I'm just going to leave that like that just to see if it'll ever go out or what it'll look like at the end of the video. So let's go ahead and throw ourselves down this again. Why do those keep coming off? I don't know. But it's it's kind of annoying. All right, here we go. Boom! There we go. Look at all those pieces of cardboard. Now this really makes me want a full cardboard car. Like every single part in the car is just cardboard. That would be awesome. And then I could reenact that uh, short film where they just had like a... a like a war scenario set out with like a giant cardboard tank and cardboard guns. You guys seen that? It's kind of an older video. Still awesome. Anyway, I'd love to see that. Anyway, let's see what else we can do here. Should we go around this loop? We're never going to make it, but um, we can try, I guess. <laughs> if we do make it, I'm going to be amazed. Maybe we can get a little bit of speed here. We might have a chance, but uh, it's not looking good. There goes our back bumper. Oh, no. Yeah, that's about what I expected. And smash! <laughs> oh, there's still a piece hanging on though, the front bumper. Actually, the back bumper's there too. So I guess the uh, the tape in the front is a little bit stronger than the ones on the side. I don't know if you just use like, I don't know, scotch tape for that or whatever. But um, yeah, you need to work on those because those those side panels just fall right the hell off. Oh no! It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about. It. All right. So what else is there to smash? On this on this map, I don't know. There's so much to do on this map. I still need to make a part two on this map because there's still so much I haven't shown you. But I kind of want to go down this monstrosity. We're never gonna make it, <laughs> but it's fun to try. You know what I mean? Maybe if we tried enough times over the course of all our videos, we might make it to the bottom in one piece. You never know. All right, here we go. Maybe we'll make it the first time. I'm not sure, but uh, uh oh, uh oh, I forgot about these. I forgot about these. I forgot about these. There goes all our rims. Oh, no, our hubcaps, sorry. Oh, my God, it's just peeling them away. Uh-oh, uh-oh. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Everything's fine. Oh, no, that big red ball is coming up really quick. Oh, we missed it. Oh, we missed Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. Oh! Oh, <laughs> Are you okay, Stig? The engine is gone. Where did the engine go? Probably somewhere down the, the rest of the ramp. I'm not really sure. There's cardboard flying by. Oh, that is awesome. Okay, let's try this again. I forgot that there's a path you have to take. I feel like this this should be possible though. I'm not I'm not gonna I'm not I think the rule should be we can't let off the uh the gas though, so. Oh, there goes a lot of cardboard. Oh, we're getting some air. This is fine. I planned for this. Oh no, the stig's knocked out. Oh no, we lost the stig. We lost the stig. Oh, this is fine. This is fine. We're on fire. Okay, that's not fine. I'm not going to lie. Oh, no. Oh, no. There's another wall coming up. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. We're going to... Oh, we're going to hit face first. Oh. Oh. <laughs> is this how we die? Is this how it ends? There's still pieces flying all over the dang place. Look at that. Oh, look at it go. Look at that piece of cardboard. <laughs> uh oh, are we burning now? 
Yes, we are. All right, let's check the uh, status of our other burning car. You can see it from all the way across the map, which is kind of cool. Is it still just burning away? Is there really nothing we can do to put this out? I guess not. I guess we could throw it in the water. But anyway, that has been the cardboard car 2.0, as I'm going to dub it. But yeah, if you want to download this mod, I will leave the link in the description. It's really awesome, dude. The dude who's just making these, please don't stop. These are some of my favorite mods in existence. I don't know why. They're just so charming, I guess. But uh, yeah, that's going to about do it. So make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you guys in the next one. See ya.